need to make a key slot in this workpiece and I'm gonna show you an easy way how to perfectly center the slot. Let's go to the shaper. I installed the cutting tool. This is in fact an old drill bit. I cutting tool upside down. Now, to make sure the cutting tool is perfectly square we use a piece of paper. You have more light and the square and then you can see easily it's perfectly square. Now the workpiece is secured, the cutting tool is in the boring. We're gonna push this boring bar up with a spring. Of course you don't need a spring, you can use a rubber band or whatever. The spring of course is pushing the boring bar up and the tool is touching the upside of the workpiece. Now it's time to install the indicator. I don't have this fancy indicator stands so I use a magnet. Now if we move the tool we have a readout. Now as everyone knows the center of this workpiece is the highest spot. So we're gonna search for the highest spot with the indicator. High spot, perfectly in center. Let's make the cut. I install the dial indicator against the table because the cutting tool is 3.5 millimeters and I need to make a slot of 5 millimeters so I have to move the table a bit. Indicator always useful. touch off, put the zero, there you go, touch, we're gonna lock the clapper box, that's done, put zero, Looks good. A little bit of play. Almost nothing. That will do.
I'm going to install this spring on the back side. Escape! <laughs> <laughs> 